Hey there everyone, this is Danielle, checking out Chicory, A Colourful Tale. Uh, as you may know, I've been feeling a bit burnt out on recording anything essentially for the past couple of weeks, so I figured I'd try to get back into the swing of it by playing a game that I've been looking forward to and that I almost certainly will absolutely love. And that's this game. Uh, so this is an indie game that came out about a month ago, uh, a little bit more than that at this point I think. Uh, it's a game about a dog with a magic paintbrush, which sounds super adorable. And the soundtrack is written by Lena Rain, who also did the music for Celeste. Um, so that's really exciting. Uh, and I also happen to know that this game, uh, in English, does not ever ask you for your character's gender. But in French, it does. Uh, presumably because French is harder to write like in a gender-neutral way. So there's actually a speedrun tactic of playing in English to not get prompted for your gender, which is just the most wonderful thing I've ever heard. <laughs> uh, so we're gonna have a quick look. I've already been through the options a little bit um, to get it to record right, So, but I'm gonna have another look now. Um, so yeah, we've got our language here. It's English, uh, we've got French, we've got Spanish, we've got Portuguese, Brazilian Portuguese. Uh, that's German, uh, I think that's Turkish, and Italian are the options. I don't know if they'll, I'll be adding more, but that's what there are right now. Uh, we got standard graphics stuff, resolution, vertical sync. We also have some accessibility options here. You can turn on this eye strain helper, uh, which makes the screen, you know, more red, basically. <laughs> uh, you can turn off flashing effects and screen shake if you want, which is good. I don't know if it's if you're recommended to play with a controller or with the keyboard and mouse. So uh, I've got my controller here connected up, but I've also got a keyboard and mouse here, so we'll see how we go. It sounds like you might want to use a keyboard and mouse because they're talking about a cursor here. So we might want to be able to move around, uh, you know, our mouse cursor to point at stuff, but we'll see how, we'll see how it goes. Uh, you can turn rumble off or turn it down, that kind of thing. Uh, as well as having normal audio settings like volume, you can also turn off wet sounds, which might be gross, which I think is just lovely. Um, I think that's a really sweet feature to include. Uh, you can mess with the text scroll speed, you can turn off text animations which might be distracting, uh, you can change the fun fonts to like more readable fonts if, I don't know, I guess that, that's for like people with uh, vision impairment, that kind of thing, uh, which is nice. Uh, there's all, more accessibility options here, you can give the player lots more health if you want, I'm going to leave that on the default. You can change the reaction speed necessary down to 25%. Uh, there are content warnings. I'm going to turn these on just to see what they are. I'd like to see what it warns about. Uh, similar to uh, Ikenfell, a game I played a little while ago, it's got that option, which is nice. Apparently you can also skip boss fights. Um, again, like Ikenfell, which is good. And down here is like debug stuff, kind of. Uh, I think Luncheon is like the main hub world or something like that. I haven't started the game yet, so I'm not really sure. You reset all the settings and you can view the credits if you want. So yeah, uh, we're just gonna actually dive in and play the game, and I don't really know what to expect beyond the fact that you play as a dog who doesn't have a gender, so... <laughs> uh, let's get in. Uh, it's also got co-op. Uh, I haven't really got anyone to play with here, but uh, I'll probably have a look at that later. I think it's local co-op, I'm not sure if it's gotten like an online mode, but... Eh, either way, it's very cool. Uh, I'm not sure if having my face in this corner will be a problem. Uh, I may need to move it around depending on what happens. <laughs> so for the moment, let's just dive in and see how we go. Uh, okay, begin. What's your favorite food? Um, I don't really know, honestly. How much, is that a limit of char characters? Chocolate cake, yeah, you can't type in, you can't type in more characters than it's showing there. Um, what's my pizza? There we go. And there's a not sure option if you don't really know, which I guess I should have picked, but I want to see what happens. A magic paintbrush. Every stroke fills our world with color. <clears throat> Naturally, someone has to wield it. The brush has been passed down through the ages. But the current wielder, Chicory, Oh, by the way, it is pronounced chicory. I looked it up. Um, it's a real word. It's like a type of plant um, with a bit pretty blue flowers. So yeah, chicory. Oh, she's so cool. A total genius. Oh, good for her. 
The world's never looked better thanks to her. Oh no, I have to measure up to her, don't I? Oh no. <laughs> and that's why it's up to me. Keep her tower clean. Oh, I'm the dog. There we go. Uh... Oh, I see. I can I can brush the tower. I'm basically clicking and moving my mouse around. And it's sweeping the tower. Oop. Hmm? Hmm? Guess I'll keep cleaning the tower. <laughs> I assume I'll do this like three times and then something else will happen. <gasps> oh no! All of Chicory's colors must have cleaned too hard. Gotta go tell her right away. Uh, I'd love to, but how do I do that? Is it Wacid? Yeah, it's Wacid. Wield a tower. Odd. Wasn't they color here earlier? Yeah, it looks like you're probably intended to use a mouse because there's a lot of cursory stuff in the game. Portrait? Oh yeah, this portrait. It's Armand, the classic wielder. One of the first to really show her personality in her coloring. After her, wielder's styles became much more diverse. I have to respect her legacy. Hmm, this one. I think this one is carrot? He was okay. Really experimental. Even at the time, I don't think he was very popular. But I know he has some fans still. Ooh, this one's parfait. He was colourful and heroic, just like chicory. Oh, look at that smile. <laughs> if she were here, she'd probably say, Don't worry, pizza. Fine that all the colours just vanished for no reason. Wait, is pizza the name of my dog? Did I actually name my character there when it said, What's your favourite food? Cause that's super cute. Should probably stop procrastinating. Hickory needs to know what's going on. But I want to look at all the paint paintings. Oh, I can't. I can only look at a few of them. All right, off we go. <laughs> Hickory's room. Hickory. I'm sure she's here, but it's locked. Ah, oh, everyone must be panicking. She left her brush just lying there. What should I do? What if I use the brush? Like she would. I'm sure she'd appreciate the help. Maybe at least for a bit. Let's take it. <laughs> you got the brush. <laughs> Achievement unlocked. Helpful. Oh, you can't see that. There's a Steam overlay. Um, this game is on Steam and PlayStation 4. I think 4. Maybe 5. Um, but yeah, I'm playing the Steam version. Okay, so I can make things blue now. Still locked. Hope she's okay. Good thing she has me to help. Okay, so I think that's the only colour I have access to. Oh, I see. Right click lets me erase what I've done. I assume I'll get more colours than Cyan as we progress. Chapter 1. The Dark Forest. Luncheon. Upper woods this way. Oh, oh hello, look at this. That's an interesting feature. I guess it's an accessibility kind of thing, like if, it, if you can't see it, you can drag it somewhere else where you can. Oh, that's where Blackberry lives! The wielder before Chicory, a living legend. Maybe she knows what's going on? But I should check on the townspeople too. Nibble tunnel this way. I don't know what that is, but let's go that way. Canvas number four. This used to be one of Chicory's paintings. I guess it got wiped too. Hot like Art Academy is in charge of these. Pizza's house. I guess this is, this is my house? It's my house! Huh, I guess it's fairly 
boss, keeping the tower clean's always been priority one. Sit. Oh, look, we're having a little sit. Oh, you can't really see that because my face is in the way. <laughs> uh, let's do another one over here. Boop. Boop. Ooh, woo. <laughs> okay, let's go. Does that stay? Like, if I go back? Yeah, it's all still there. Oh. <laughs> hello, hello, pizza. Care for a small gardening tip? Some flowers grow when in colour. Others grow when they went blank. If you wish to erase a coloured one, you can use right click. Okay, so... Oh, I see. Oop, the flowers grow when I pop them with my little brush. Oop, oop. That bush seems to have something going on. Oh, there's a cat! Lost kid. You found a lost kid! Sure did. One of my many skills. I would like some more colours to work with. <laughs> oh my goodness. Okay. Up here. Howdy do, pizza. Hickory gave you the brush. Have you developed your style yet? There are many ways to colour. I know what mine would be. I'd use Alt or X to make my brush huge and colour everything super fast. That's definitely the best style. Hmm. I think I'd use Alt or X to make my brush smaller and, and plus to zoom in. So I can take my time adding small details. No, that's wrong. That's a horrible style. <laughs> so hang on, if I press Alt... Oh, I see, if I tap the button, it makes my brush smaller, and then bigger, and then bigger. Okay. So I can, I can brush over a bigger area, or a really precise little area. Interesting. And plus to zoom in. Oh yeah, I can go boop, and then I can get a good look at just this little area. Interesting. And then minus... okay. Picked up some litter! Oh no, litter! Oh, you look grumpy. What's wrong, Macaroon? Boy! My house ain't got colours no more! Fix it! Give me some tough colours! You got it? Tough colours only! And if you didn't already know, you can change colour with the mouse wheel or Z. Oh, I can? Chop chop! Oh, cool, I can. Uh, what's tough? Purple... I don't think I have any tough colours. Is this tough? Like, it's it's pink. Is pink a tough colour? I don't know. <laughs> Is this tough enough for you? <laughs> uh, and we'll put some green on this side. Oi! Those colours, they're so... soft. I love them! <laughs> you really did a bang-up job. I gotta thank you. You got... brim cap. Yeah, I'll wear that. Yeah! Hope you like I love that hat, as much as I love these tough colours. Thanks again. <laughs> hey, Pumpernickel. You can really thought you were worthy of the brush, hmm? Builders simply aren't as good as they used to be. I miss the days of Blackberry. Hey! Chicory is an amazing wielder! Well, if you like that sort of thing. The Blackberry lives to the southeast in the Supper Woods. You should go and meet her. Suppose I should. Oh, a little goat. Hello. You know about drawing with other people? If you pause with P and select Begin Co-op, someone else can play with you as an extra brush. Drawing together can be nice. It always helps me relax. Oh, you're a sweetie. Boop. 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 I, 
like, I assumed I would unlock colors as I progressed, but it looks like you actually do start with quite a few, so... There we go, lovely. <laughs> oh no, what's wrong with you? Hello, Lemon! Uh, oh, hello, Pizza! Everything lost colour suddenly. What's going on? And why do you have Chicory's brush? It feels like something is horribly wrong. Well, if you have the brush, can you colour my house back in? Um, however you like. Only around the edges a little bit, but that should be okay. <laughs> there we go, and that can be. Oh, um, th th thank you, but I'm sorry. Can you erase it a bit? Y you can use right click to do that. Uh, I'll tell you when to stop erasing. Oh, that's enough. Thanks. It, it wasn't how I liked it before, but, but you can colour it again if you want. I, I'd really like if you coloured it d differently. Oh, sweetie. If I put some blue on the roof, would you like that? I mean, cyan. It's it's not really blue. Cyan. Did that make you feel better? And this part purple? Oh, I made you purple as well, sorry. <laughs> Oop. Uh, what did I just press? Okay, the C button. Apparently, puts me into dress up mode. Collection. Dress up. Overalls? Ooh, okay, so I can get different clothes down there as well. Uh, I was wearing the brim cap already. Let me, uh, make it purple. There we go. And the overalls. There we go. I assume I'll get more clothes as I go. It looks like a whole bunch of stuff is going to unlock. <laughs> I have three clothes, one lost kid, and one litter. And that's the brush. Mm -hmm. Upper woods. Oh, I see. I need to learn that I can paint these to make them go out of the way. Clever. Kitty! Come here, lost kid. You found a lost kid! <laughs> uh, what's over here? Why would I want to come over here? Oh, I can get up here. I see. Oh, and then I need to erase this so I can walk on top of them. Oh, I see. We're doing some puzzles. A gift? You got a beanie! Yeah, let's wear it. Heck yeah, let's go. <laughs> Oh, now I can walk on top of these ones. Hello, are you Blackberry? Did Chicory give you that brush? Y yeah! Oh, it's worse than I thought. You don't seem ready. I hope I'm wrong. Come this way. Upper woods. Oh, little slingshot thingies. Okay. <laughs> and it turned me yellow as well. <laughs> well, at least I want to get that. How do I reach it? Hmm. Can I just stand on it and go boop? No, that pushes you away. Hmm. I wonder how you reach that. Is there something else I can activate nearby? I'm missing. Doesn't look like it though. Maybe I need a new ability or something.
Hope there should be another one of those plants just here, but there's not. But yeah, I'll get, get the ability to do that later. Oops. Alright, well, I'm confused. What are we doing here? Oop. Oh, okay. We can go this way. I don't really where I'm trying to go. Is there a map or something? That would be nice. Can I follow that vine? Or is that just like a paintable thing? Gift! You got a sun hat! Yeah, let's wear it. Let's go. Oh yeah, that looks amazing. <laughs> yeah, this is definitely better played with a keyboard and mouse, I think. Because the whole game is about, you know, clicking on things in order to paint them. Oops. Right, that makes sense. Um, hmm. In there as well. Hmm. Maybe they just don't have something I need yet. I don't think I can actually get onto that. Because they're going to fling me the wrong way. Unless I can... Oh, okay, I can just hold down the button and I'll go the right way. Okay, that makes sense. <laughs> Can I reach that? Not yet. Oh, uh, actually I probably can if I just, uh... Paint these again. There we go. There we go. Get this. Is it another piece of clothing? <gasps> A hoodie! Yes, let's wear it! Oh, that's what I'm talking about. Uh... I think I have different colours based on where I am. Because, yeah, I don't have cyan anymore. Like, maybe the area of the game I'm in determines what colours I'm allowed to use. Mmm, that's not good. Red, maybe? I like that. Now I'm yellow again because I got splattered by that thing. <laughs> Litter! I got it! Wanna go in this cave? Yum cave. Oh, it's dark. Uh, can I make some light by painting things? Like these little mushrooms? Doesn't look like that makes them brighter. Hmm. I can paint the... I can't paint these little fireflies by the looks of things. Must be an ability I'm missing or, so or something. Hmm. I might come back to that once I figured some some more stuff out. Oh, I see. The word says it says supple woods in various colors, and those are the colors you get to use in the area. That's really interesting. I like that. Hmm. Can I paint it while I'm on it? No, it doesn't work that way. Cool. Give me that present. You got scarf. Yeah, I'll wear that. Oh, yeah, that's what I'm talking about. All the clothing. <laughs> Phone booth? The only number I have memorized is my parents. I guess I could call them. They always know what to do when I'm lost or stuck. They're the best. Oh, look at that little smile. Uh, no, I think I know what I'm doing. So that's a, that's a hint system. Here's a house. Any, any clues in here? Or can I just sit down? I'm not seeing anything notable. 
Oh, this looks spooky. What have we here? Oh, there we go. Finally made it. This is what I wanted to show you. Never seen anything like it. But if Chicory thinks you deserve the brush, it's your responsibility to face it. Uh, what exactly is going on? What happened to my apprentice's colours? And where is she? Shouldn't be here. This is a danger to all of us. <gasps> oh no. Oh, we're in the, in the, oh no. Um. The spooky. Ah! I think it's like if you get two hits in quick succession you die. It looks like you heal at the end of each like cycle. Ow. giving me Undertale vibes, the way this is designed. Oh, my brush went away. Does that mean I won? What's happening? <laughs> Chapter 2. A Wielder's Duty. Can you playing? Absolutely. Oh? Oh, I'm asleep? What was that? A corruption. Out of nowhere, it started growing here. But even I didn't expect it to attack. I only got out thanks to you. Hickory could learn a thing or two from you. My old apprentice. This is all her responsibility. She should never have sent you. He's a coward. How could I have trust- Stop! Saying bad things about chicory. He didn't give me the brush. I took it. And I might not know what's going on, but whatever it is, chicory can handle it. You don't know her at all. You messed up, kiddo. You have no idea how precious that brush is. You risked us all by taking it. I... I didn't think about that. You're lucky to be alive right now. If you know what's good for you, you'll take that brush right back to Chicory and luncheon. Go! The brush. Powered up! Your bond with the brush. Uh... 
What does that mean? Your paint will now glow in dark places. Oh, okay. So I can get through dark rooms now. But you probably should still give it back to Chicory. Okay, so now if I head over that cave I was looking at earlier, which is this way, I think. I can now get through here. Yum cave. Yeah, my brush should glow here in the cave, which means I should be able to find my way through. Yeah. Very spooky. Um, not really sure we're trying to go here. Oh, it's like a shortcut. I think I saw this cave earlier. Yeah, okay, it's just a shortcut to get back. We are now in luncheon again. Okay. Oh, I didn't talk to you. Hello, Pickle. Oh, hey, Pizza. Is that a brush? Did you steal it? Lol, whatevs. Oh no. <laughs> a little bit. <laughs> oh, this is the place, right? Wield a tower. Hickory! Are you there? I have your brush. I took it, but I shouldn't have. Um, can I come in? I just want to give you your brush back. Fine. Come in. Content warning. Depression. To skip, pause with P and select skip cutscene. Oh no, sweetie. Oh. Okay, so yeah, content warnings are in this game. Oh, baby. Chicory! Oh, that... Canada. Pizza, right? Yes. I'm sorry for taking your brush. I was confused with all the colour gone. Um, you don't know why that happened, do you? No. Anyway, um, please take it back. Actually... Forget it. Huh? You keep it. Huh? I can't take this from you. You're a wielder. The best one ever. Not anymore. I don't understand. I, I really look up to you. Taking this means everything to me. Just take it. Okay, I'll do it. I'll call it everything back in and make you proud, Chicory. Sure. Now leave me alone. Oh no, sweetie. This help? Hey. Stop that. Okay, that doesn't help. Uh. Hey! I said stop that. Oh, it's annoying. Okay, so I don't, she doesn't want me to colour anything in the room, not just her. Okay. Well, I'm gonna leave then. I'll do my best, Chicory. Any tips on using the brush? No. Oh, sweetie. Oh, dear. Oh! Uh, excuse me. I was looking for the wielder. But, um... I thought it was Chicory. I'm... The new wielder! What seems to be the problem? It's the wielder temple. Some creepy trees grew all over it. All the colours vanished. It's a total mess. 
especially because it's the Wielder Temple. I thought Chicory might know what to do. I can handle it. Okay. I'll have to take the Nibble Tunnel to Potluck. Um, but the whole tunnel went pitch black. So scary getting here. Okay, bye. I'm gonna take a moment to colour in some of these trees. Oops. There we go. That looks lovely. Oh, there's some litter up there. Hang on. Got it. Okay, let's go to Nibble Tunnel. Just over here somewhere, right? Ah, there it is. Uh, how do I get there? Doesn't seem like I can reach it. Um, oh, I think I know what I'm supposed to do. I just go through here. Paint these so I can get through this little gap here. Okay, okay, I see. It was a little puzzle, but I figured it out. <laughs> uh, this is over here. I'm really worried about Chikori. I hope she'll be okay. You got pocket jacket. Yeah, let's wear it. I'd love to have pockets. Oh, you can't wear the scarf and a hat because they're the same, like, section, even though, theoretically, you can wear them together. Okay, yep, it's dark in here. I need to do some bit of brushing around so we can have a look around at what's happening. My paint glows in the dark with its powers. Not like this way, dinner's this way. Is everything in the game named after food? Because that is incredibly charming. Dinners? Oh, I can't get across there. I must need my brush to have a new power of some kind. What luck is this way, though? Now I can see what I'm doing. Uh, we need darkness over there. So those mushrooms go plump. There we go. What the heck is that thing? Oh, those bugs like run out and put the lights out real quick. That's scary. I don't like that at all. Let me just get this present. I got the black dress! Yeah, let's wear it. Let's have a dress. Excellent. Okay, let's get out of this room because it's scary. Uh, this way. Okay. <laughs> oh my god. Uh, yep, there's another present. I'd love, I'd love, I love presents. Favorite. I'm having trouble flipping that the way I want to go. Maybe it only works if there's more than one? I don't really know how this works. Oh god, there's more of the scary bugs. I don't like them. Okay, present, 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 present. I want... I want the present. Of interest doesn't look like it. 
Yeah, I can flip to here. Uh, I'll flip over to here. Oh, right, they, those both launch you too far for it to for you to go another way. Uh, let me see here. What other options do I have? Oh, I can go this way. Oops. If we get down where the creepy bugs are, but also get the gift. Big star. Uh, I like the hat I'm wearing. I'll put that, put that away for now. Oh, yeah. Okay, we flip to here, flip across to here, and we're out of the room. Okay. Okay, let's try going this way first. There might be a gift of some kind. Oh, you can't walk over the holes. Okay, go this way. Oh, hello. Oh, boy, am I glad to see you. I got completely lost coming back. Getting through the dark is so hard. And the cave is full of creepy bugs. Can you paint a line from, from me to the exit? That would help a lot. Thank you. Bit of an escort mission kind of thing. I'm trying, but they're erasing it so quickly. If I dodge the crystals, it'll be okay. No, no, it's not okay. Maybe there's another route I can take? I don't, I don't get it. Maybe I make it smaller. Hang on. Yeah, okay. I think I can get through without them actually getting going too close to them so they don't warm. Yeah. Okay, that makes sense. I'd use a smaller brush was the trick there. Hey Turnip, we're nearly there. Nearly there. There you go. We're free! Ah, uh, thank you! Well, I might never get out of there. Please take this. You got... Kerchief! Yeah, I'll wear that. Oh, that's cute. Well, I'm going back home to Potluck. Come and visit sometime. And don't forget the Wheel the Temple. You gotta fix it. Oh, a big present over there. I'm gonna want that eventually. Oh, there's a rock here. I'm just gonna kind of get rid of it yet. A little bit of a sort of Metroidvania vibe. A little bit. Hot luck. Boy, kiddo. Oh, it's Dad. Hey, Dad. You're, you're a raccoon or something. Finally got away from your girlfriend to visit? Yeah, <laughs> I'm kidding. Um, good to see you, though. Ma says you're the wielder now. Proud of you, kiddo. Wanna give me a hand with something? I want the holy shop to get coloured again. Something flashy. Does Dad think I have a girlfriend, but I don't? Or is that is that what, what that was about? I'm a little confused. Oh, it's like a donut. 
Okay. So let's use this color and this color. That looks pretty cool. Oh yeah! Pizza, that looks great! Thanks so much! Oh yeah, I have something for you. Now that you travel around so much, I don't want you getting lost. You got a camera map! Oh perfect, I wanted a map. One of those fancy new camera maps. So you can take photos with it and stuff too. Just press M to open it. I'll head back home now. Of course, if you ever need anything. M. Oh, wonderful. I assume it'll fill out as I go different places. Can I paint the black dress or is it stuck black? I think it's stuck black. It's called a black dress for a reason. <laughs> Young people these days. They barely make time to talk to others. Maybe they'll interact once, but then they move on. Don't they realize how much they're missing? I try to interact with everyone multiple times. Even when they do interact, they'll use Control or B to skip through the conversation quickly. Why can't they take the time to pause and listen? Maybe I'm just slow. Appreciate your stopping to listen. Maybe the young folks are doing it right after all. Why don't you take this? You got some trash. Thanks. <laughs> um, thanks. <laughs> Can I talk to you again? Nope, that's it. Okay, boop. You're red now. <laughs> Hi, Custard. A new wielder, what an honor. Did you come because of our boy Turnip? Yes, yes, we sent him. We saw the strange growth from the temple with our own eyes. What's worse, the wagon is completely blocked. Yeah, we're hoping to go see the art. Usually so lovely. Okay, your name's Custard, your name's Treacle. Oh, what a wonderful pair. <laughs> That's Turnip there, the one that has some colour. Oh, I see something wiggling. <gasps> a kitty! You found a lost kid. <laughs> hey, Grits. I'm glad my little bro turnip is okay. I love the kid, but he's a bit of a goofball. I've always got to keep an eye on him. Well, you can do even better now that you're red. Ritter Granita. Hello. Hello. <laughs> hey, turnip. Hello. Please don't tell my family about how I got lost coming here. I'll never hear the end of it. Big family, isn't it? I've always been the baby. You're always on my case about getting lost and needing help. Which did happen again this time. But I was so close. Basically. I'm always getting lost somehow. Poor can barely make it to the holy shop from here. He made it to luncheon and back this time. Maybe he ain't just a, ain't just a kid no more. One time Turnip went to grab us some holies. Are holies like donuts? And he just didn't come back. And I'm like, the holy shop is right there. Apparently he got scared by a bug. And then he wound up halfway across Picnic. That's classic turnip. He finally came back with holies in the dead of night. I was too guilty to tell him I'd already went and got some. I always wanted to be in charge of something important. That's why I was excited to talk to the wielder about the temple. Well, what did you? What do you think? Did I do a good job? Can I say yes? Have you been to the wielder temple? If you're a wielder, you must have, right? Got all sorts of history on the wielder and the brush. Yeah, and lovely art too. The national treasure. We hope you can fix it. Our family's been here in potluck for generations. Since before the art academy. Did you know a mouse was one of the first wielders? Don't underestimate it just because we're small. The art academy and temple are old as dirt. But all around it, potluck has changed over the years. Kids travel here from all over for the school. We're lucky to be surrounded by family here. Oh, hello. Hi, Radish. Clementine. Is that Clementine? Pizza! Mum said you might be visiting. How amazing. Oh, this is my BFF, Radish. I'm so honoured to meet a famous talent like you. Um, thanks. People like your sister and I bust our butts every day. Do I have a sister? Oh, is Clementine my sister? Practicing art, honing our craft, just to get a shot. Maybe someday wielding status like yours. 
You must be some kind of genius. Um, I'll do a class sometime. I'd love to learn from a master like you. Sorry, I promise she's not always like that. She's right though. She is? Definitely. You should come to an art class. Uh, oh. They're inside here. Do it. <laughs> he lives here. Oh, pizza! Hi, Mom. Oh it's, oh, it's my parents' house. Oh, it's true, then. Hickory really gave you the brush. Yep. Oh, pizza. That's incredible. I always talked about wanting to be like her. So proud of you. Thanks! Dad and I heard you'd be coming to Potluck. What with the growth at the Wielder Temple? You must be so busy. Well, I won't keep you. Don't be afraid to call any time, okay? Good to see you, pizza. Are you doing okay with everything? Are your teeth clean? Did you pick up your transit ID yet? Ah, mom! <laughs> of course I have. You're a terrible liar. You've been of age for years now. Take care of that in dinners after your wielder duties. I can't believe you're really a wielder. Ed and I didn't even know that was an option. Or, um, a cleaner. If anything, we thought it might be your sister someday. Well, still could be. What a talented family. We're so blessed. If you're ever lost or unsure what to do, you can always call us here. You know our number. Just use a phone booth. So, how's the wielding going? You winning, kid? <laughs> oh, what a wonderful game. No, no, I worry about you, you know. Maybe we worry too much. I'm sure you know what you're doing. Shop's going alright. Folks will always love holies. I don't think I'd ever look at one again. Used to bring home so many. <laughs> oh, I made you sick of holies? Still like them. You know, I always figured, since your sister was the artist, that maybe you'd run the holy shop someday. Dad, I don't even like holies. Looks like you just need more of them. Yeah, ha ha ha, I'm kidding. But really, kiddo. Sometimes work ain't about what you love. Sometimes it's just a thing you do. I like what I'm doing. You're a good one, kiddo. Whatever you do, I know you'll be fine. Ah, uh, boop. Can I paint the paintbrush itself? Oh, I see. This just shows where my power-ups are. There's the glow. So I'm noticing, like, the end of the brush is painted, but the rest of the brush is not. I don't think I can paint the brush with the brush, because it's the brush. <laughs> Broccoli. I study and teach art history here. Recent events have proven to be quite a crisis. We haven't anticipated such a sudden, drastic loss of colour. So many old wielder artworks have vanished at once. For some pieces, all we have are black and white reproductions. Generally, wielder colours do fade very, very slowly. Early enough that you'd barely notice in a lifetime. That's something we know thanks to the work of Dr. Cheese. It's also why we need re wielders to occasionally touch up old works. I suppose you've got your work cut out for you. Uh, some garbage. Fine now. Actually, this owl looks kind of like a garbage can. Are you the recycling owl? <laughs> Miso, you've gotten so much taller. Pizza, you're still really short. <laughs> We're done school now. That's so cool. I can't believe you grow up so fast. Well, I can't believe my old babysitter is the wielder. Uh, I'm a babysitter? I remember staying up late watching scary movies. Oh yes, my parents would never show me them. But I loved scary movies so much. I'm terrified of them. You'd always scream the loudest. I wanted to impress you and be the cool babysitter. Well, the screaming didn't come off very cool. But you were, undoubtedly, the coolest babysitter. I want to work in public service after I graduate. I think I'll move north to dinners. Maybe work at Province Hall if I'm lucky. Wow, so important. Good luck. Thanks. That's my house. I'm not quite sure where the temple I'm going to is. I think it's this way. Oh, hello. 
Oh, I don't know what to do. People of Eleven Seas are trapped. It was some kind of rock slide. My family is there, and the old wheel the cardamom. I don't know what anyone can do about it. Uh, I can help. I'm the new wielder, actually. But doesn't that just mean you're an artist? What can you do about fallen rocks? Oh, I don't know. But I'll figure it out. Couscous. I love you, Couscous. I'm guessing I'm gonna I'm gonna learn a way to get rid of fall, fallen rocks. Like, I don't know, paint them to be more fragile or something. Will the temple this way? Oh, hello, what do we got here? Oh, that's interesting. Oh, gift! Cute dress! Yes, let's wear the cute dress. Let's always wear the cute dress. <laughs> I want glasses. I don't know if the game has glasses. It probably does, but I haven't seen them yet. I'm trying to scroll through these, but I'm doing it wrong. So yeah, sun hat, bandana, broom cap, chief. I think because the sun hat probably looks good with that. There we go. A nice combo. Build a temple. What is this thing? Blocking the way to the temple. Ugh, it must be more old wielder stuff. I guess I better ask some wielder about it. But preferably not blackberry. Or chicory. Okay, I'm guessing I have to colour it in appropriately to unlock it. A A Appy Foothills. It would be a lot simpler if Chicory, if um, Pizza could just jump up. <laughs> you got flower! Oh, let's wear the flower. Oh, of course. Oh, that's beautiful. Let's go. <laughs> okay, there's some rocks I can't break. I assume I'll learn how, but I haven't done it yet. Oh, interesting. Um, doesn't get me where I want to be, but it's a start. Let me grab that litter. There we go. How do I get to here, is my question. Yeah, you can't just jump back over there because it flings you too far. Oh, there we go. Gift. I got a howdy. I'll oh, put that away. The flower's better. Oh, what have we here? Oh, this looks interesting. There we go. <laughs> I got I Nuna. Neat. I was hoping there'd be a clue here somewhere about what I'm supposed to do with that uh like combination lock thingy at the entrance, but it doesn't look like it. Big present, big present. Here I come, big present. Oh no, there's a, there's a, there's a breakable thing that I can't break. Um, looks like this explosive has something to do with it. I'm not really sure what it does yet though. Maybe I learned to climb vines and also how to break rocks? I don't know.
Bada pop, bada pop. Hmm. There's a better climber. There has to be someone out there who knows about it. Yeah, I've got to go have a look for someone who can help me. We are coming up to about an hour though, so... Uh, I think I just basically want to say this game is incredibly charming <laughs> and I love it and I'm going to be having lots of fun with it. Um, yeah, it's available on Steam and I think the PS4? Let me just bring up my browser real quick. It says PS Store. Uh, let me click through and see what that, that means. Da, 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 da. Yes, for PS4 and PS5. It's available for both. Okay, so yeah, this is a game. Um, I really like it. Great GIF? Oh, that's neat. <laughs> so yeah, uh, Chicory, a colourful tale. You can buy it on Steam, you can buy it on the PS Store if you want to play it on a PlayStation. It looks like you probably want to play it with a mouse because the game is all about, like, clicking on things to give them different colours. Uh, but you could probably play it with a controller. Like, if I grab my controller here, you can move around with the controller and move your cursor with the right stick. Like, that's what I'm doing right now, and it works. Make it face so you can see what I'm doing. That's the right stick, that's the left stick. You can play it that way, but I think the precision of having a mouse is probably preferable for this type of game. Um, but yeah, so that's, uh, that's Chicory. Um, and I like it. <laughs> and I think it's pretty great. Um, I would recommend this wholeheartedly. Um, so far the music, of course, is beautiful. Uh, the visuals are super, super cute. Uh, you've got a bunch of... Oh, salt and caramel? Oh, that's so cute. <laughs> oh, all the naming is so adorable. I wonder what happens if you name yourself the same as another player who's already in the game. Like, if I called myself Couscous or Caramel or whatever. Hmm. Barley? <laughs> oh, it's a very cute game. Kitty. Oh, I can't get to the kitty. I can see the kitty, but I can't get over there because I can't cross this water. Oh, that's a bit rude. I assume I'll get an ability that lets me cross water at some point, but right now I can't reach him. Oh, and the water itself actually soaks up the colour. Interesting. Okay, anyway, yeah. Uh, this is Chicory. It's a super cute game. It, it's got really cool things to it. It's got all the accessibility features we saw earlier. It's got super adorable characters. You're a little dog holding a paintbrush who does not have a gender. <laughs> oh, gosh. Uh, it looks like it's, it's just, it looks looks like it's going to be a fantastic game, and I'm having a heap of fun with it so far, and I would wholeheartedly recommend it, and I love it, and I'm going to probably listen to the soundtrack for years to come because it's beautiful. <laughs> so yeah, that's the game. Thank you for watching. I hope you enjoyed. Bye. <laughs>